Welcome to Liturgy of the Hours with Deacon Kevin. This is evening prayer. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The setting sun now dies away, and darkness comes as close of day. Your brightest beams, dear Lord, impart, and let them shine within our heart. We praise your name with joy this night. Please watch and guide us till the light, joining the music of the blessed. O Lord, we sing ourselves to rest. To God the Father, God the Son, and Holy Spirit three in one, Trinity blessed, whom we adore, be praise and glory evermore. The Lord surrounds his people with strength. Those who put their trust in the Lord are like Mount Zion. They cannot be shaken. That stands forever. Jerusalem, the mountains surround her, so the Lord surrounds his people both now and forever. For the scepter of the wicked shall not rest over the land of the just, for fear that the hands of the just should turn to evil. Do good, Lord, to those who are good, to the upright of heart. But the crooked and those who do evil drive them away. On Israel, peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Surround your people, Lord, within the safety of your church, which you preserve on its rock foundation. Do not let us stretch out our hands to evil deeds, nor be destroyed by the insidious snares of the enemy, but bring us to share the lot of the saints in light. The Lord surrounds his people with strength. Unless you acquire the heart of a child, you cannot enter the kingdom of God. O oh Lord, my heart is not proud, nor haughty my eyes. I have not gone after things too great, nor marvels beyond me. Truly, I have set my soul in silence and peace. As a child has rest in his mother's arm, even so my soul. O oh Israel, hope in the Lord, both now and forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord Jesus, gentle and humble of heart, you declared that whoever receives a little child in your name receives you, and you promised your kingdom to those who are like children. Never let pride reign in our hearts, but may the Father's compassion reward and embrace all who willingly bear your gentle yoke. Unless you acquire the heart of a child, you cannot enter the kingdom of God. Lord, you have made us a kingdom and priest for God our Father. O oh Lord our God, you are worthy to receive glory and honor and praise and power. For you have created all things. By your will they came to be and were made. Worthy are you, O oh Lord, to receive the scroll and break open its seals. For you were slain. With your blood you purchased for God men of every race and tongue, of every people and nation. You made of them a kingdom and priests to serve our God, and they shall reign on the earth. Worthy is the Lamb that was slain to receive power and riches, wisdom and strength, honor and glory and praise. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord, you have made us a kingdom and priest for God our Father. A reading from Romans chapter 12. Your love must be sincere. Detest what is evil. Cling to what is good. Love one another with the affection of brothers. Anticipate each other in showing respect. Do not grow slack, but be fervent in the spirit. He whom you serve is the Lord. 
Rejoice in hope. Be patient under trial. Persevere in prayer. Through all eternity, O Lord, your promise stands unshaken. Through all eternity, O Lord, your promise stands unshaken. Your faithfulness will never fail. Your promise stands unshaken. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Through all eternity, O Lord, your promise stands unshaken. My spirit rejoices in God, my Savior. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Savior. For he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm and has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham, and to his children forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. My spirit rejoices in God, my Savior. God establishes his people in hope. Let us cry out to him with joy. You are the hope of your people, Lord. We thank you, Lord, because in Christ you have given us all the treasures of wisdom and knowledge. O oh God, in your hands are the hearts of the powerful. Bestow your wisdom upon government leaders. May they draw from the fountain of your counsel and please you in thought and deed. The talents of artists reflect your splendor. May their work give the world hope and joy. You do not allow us to be tested beyond our ability. Strengthen the weak and raise up the fallen. Through your Son you promise to raise men up on the last day. Do not forget those who have died. Remember us, Lord, when you come to your kingdom and teach us how to pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, may our evening prayer rise up to you, and your blessing come down upon us. May your help and salvation be ours now and through all eternity. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks be to God.